Hello everybody and welcome to my channel. Uh, if you're new then thank you ever so much for joining us. I hope you will subscribe um, and if you're not new then again I must say thank you ever so much for coming back. This week, a little bit different, I thought I would show you my workout gear because a lot of people have um, got involved in something called health goth or fit goth or um, words that I can't remember but um, I do a lot of fitness work because I'm obviously older I need to work on keeping my bone density and keeping hold of my muscles which over time your muscles do tend to degrade and fall away and I really try as hard as possible not to let that happen. As you know, I do run quite a lot um, for me. I used to run more, but now I just run, you know, two, three times a week, something like that. And I'm now starting training for a half marathon. I'm trying to get back into the swing of running. But the new thing for me is going to the gym. And I'm trying to go to the gym either three or four times a week, depending on how that fits in with my training. I was going four times a week, but I think with the training for the half, I will have to cut that down to three. Anyway, um, I can't rock up to the gym in day glow gym wear or, you know, matching peach outfits like a lot of the girls in there so I thought I would show you what I do wear to the gym and if you're interested in that then do please keep on watching. So I thought I would start off by showing you the things that I got to wear in the gym. Um, this year um, Mr Jane and I decided that we would join a local gym and maybe you know get a little bit fit help us with our running and stop our muscles and bones from deteriorating over time so i thought well you know i need something nice i had some yoga things and some pilates things but they were sort of quite they were made of that bamboo sort of cottony stuff and they were too warm for the gym i didn't really want to wear them so I first of all went to Unwanted Apparel and I got these rather fabulous um, Capri three-quarter length leggings and they are spectacular. They've got Baphomet heads on them, they've got um, Leviathan crosses, they've got Ordinary crosses, they've got 666, they've got pentagrams, I mean, basically, they are pretty much the leggings that were made for me. And they're very well made. They're completely squat proof. They've got a little pocket, little zip pocket on the back. So you could put um, your MP3 player or your keys or whatever you wanted in there. And I think they're wonderful. I've, they've got um, the unwanted logo here which is a black pair of lips with some vampire fangs coming out and I just think they're really really good I mean they are expensive if you buy them full price um, and I do try and get things in the sales or try and get coupons and things but if you've got a birthday coming up or maybe if you want to ask somebody to save up to get you something like this um, for Christmas or whenever it is I highly recommend them because the quality is spectacular so we'll put those on one side the next brand that I want to introduce you to is Lucy Lockett Loves now again these are very similar in fit and quality and sizing and they also have a pocket on the back nice zip pocket and these are spider webs and spiders in the design they're again they're a capri like a mid calf length so they're not something that i would wear you know in the height of the summer weather 
but you can get them in different colors i think there's a blue one but i went for the purple obviously um and i thought well spiders because they didn't really have anything spookier than spiders but i thought that was pretty spooky and again there's the logo lucy lockett loves on here she's on facebook actually if you want to go and have a look at her she's a very um keen industrious young lady and her little subheading here is be happy be healthy be strong and i can't agree more with that um if you're healthy and strong you can't help but be happy really so that's the leggings and to go with them yes i went mad and got the matching cropped bra top now i'm not gonna upset the horses by trying these on for you and i do wear a vest over the top so um i'm not you know letting it all hang out as it were when i go to the gym but these are lovely again very nice material very strong washes very well um really you can do whatever you like in these i will say that they're not um very supportive if you've got any sort of chest at all um but we'll move on to that later and of course for the gym you're not really going to do much jumping and running about um when i run i obviously use a, a running bra a proper sports bra and let me tell you the brand shock absorber you put one of those bras on to run they are not going anywhere they are solid as a rock but um having loved the design on these so much i bought another one i bought because this was in the sale and um this is the black version of the spider and spider webs design in the little um top and i just wished they'd had the capris in this because i would have bought a black pair of those as well um but i think you know you can't spend all your money all the time and i think this one was in the sale so lucy lockett loves if you're watching more spooky designs please and now we're moving on to a, another brand this brand is called LC Active and I bought some gym shorts in this brand because the weather was getting warmer and I was thinking well I don't really want to be going to the gym in pretty much full length leggings and they had these in the sale lc active move strong and as you can see they've got stars and skulls and bizarrely daisies so i'm not quite sure what's happening there but these are very comfortable again squat proof again they wash very well and with these you get a pocket on the side so i'm imagining these are for people who exercise with their phones which i don't do um but it's good for putting a tissue in or you know putting my sweat towel in when i'm there because sometimes i do actually break a sweat which um yeah i do i don't i do it a lot i'm only joking i work very hard in the gym so i got those shorts and then again i decided well they had the bra top in the sale and what i did this time was i sized down so i went down a size and this means that it really grips me i mean it's very tight to get on and quite tight to get off again as well but it really grips me and it means that when i'm doing a class where we have to do um, high knees or jumping jacks or things like that i can actually do it without having to hold the girls together to stop them bouncing around which is quite painful um so yeah again skulls and daisies the other 
thing that I wear over the top of those is a series of vests which I get in Primark plain black sporting material vests very reasonably priced again wash very well cool to wear they wick the sweat away from you and if you I sized up with these because I didn't want them to be clingy so if you get a size down in the bra to hold you in and a size up in the vest so the air moves around that seems to work for me anyway and the other things that I get from Primark are just the plain shorts I got some plain gym shorts in there because they were very reasonable as well and they're in their workout range and again they're very good I mean they don't have pockets or anything but they're really nice quality and you can do what you like in them really and they're very forgiving they're not see-through at all I have seen people in the gym in um, quite see-through leggings and you can almost read the labels inside which is not very pleasant but there we are and Primark also do their own bra tops as well so some have little padded bits in which you can take out or leave in as is your want and again very reasonably priced they usually have more sort of around the new year time when everyone is going oh god christmas i must lose weight um but i i find them in there off and on all year round and if i see them i usually grab myself one because they're always very well priced now as i said at the beginning apart from going to the gym i do run as well normally in the summer just a pair of longish shorts um, because i've found that i do get a bit of chafing on my inner thighs which i want to avoid so i've progressed now i'm bigger than i was before i was ill um, and i had a, a thigh gap back in those days now i'm bigger i wear longer legged shorts so i don't suffer from that and just a running bra and a vest and as the weather gets cooler I progress to t-shirts and my favorite t-shirt is this one which actually Mr Jane bought for me when we went to do Portsmouth Marathon together and this is the ghost race t-shirt which is an event that happens on the back it says return to the dark but I very much enjoy this shirt and wearing it out running just with like a visor or a cap and black shorts. I think it's very cool and I like to wear it on Christmas Day as well with my Father Christmas hat. So those are my sort of gothic as far as I can make it uh, fitness gear items. As I say, I do have some Pilates and yoga items and they're just plain black. There we are then, a quick canter through my gym wear and one of my running shirts. I really hope you've enjoyed this video and it's given you some ideas if you were thinking about maybe starting going to the gym or just taking up a bit of exercise at home perhaps. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already, and I will know if you haven't. Um, if you'd like to leave me um, a tip in the form of buying me a coffee, then do please go to my Ko-fi page, and thank you very much to every single person who's done so already. I really can't thank you enough. It means quite a lot when you're um, on a pension. And next time I think we'll be back to makeup but who knows make sure you look after the part of the world where you live I'm saying hello and to all your pets out there look after each other and don't forget everyone stay strange bye for now